Oh, look, I think uh, everyone who plays cricket wants to come and play here at Lords in any form of the game, but I think as a test player it's even more, more special to play uh, at Lords, simply because of the tradition and history. Uh, great players have played here and uh, left their mark and uh, to represent New Zealand here in four test matches during my career. Uh, yeah, it looked fond memories and uh, very pleased to have had that opportunity. Yeah, to get six wickets in the uh, in the first innings was, uh, was was pretty pretty special. It was a good bowling uh, bowling performance, uh, if you don't mind me saying. Um, I really adapted the conditions. The thing about bowling at Lords, because of the slope, as a pace bowler particularly, your line is absolutely crucial. And I tended to bowl from the uh, from the pavilion end, so for the off cutter it's going to go down the hill. But I was basically a leg cutter bowler, so I was looking to go the other way. So if you got too straight. To batsman, you're going to be pinged through the leg side, so I bowled just a little bit wider. Batsman couldn't afford to let me go in case it came down the hill, and if they sort of played at the ball and nibbled away at it, there was good chances of caught behind, and that's really what happened uh, in that particular innings. And uh, I got top players out uh, for memory would have been Gooch, Moxon, uh, Bill Athey, uh, Gatting. Uh, later in the innings, Edmonds and uh, and Graham Dilly. So that was a pretty special uh, performance for me and one that I remember. In fact, it was my best bowling performance statistically anyway. And I remember being interviewed by uh, Richie Benno um, at the end of the, that day's play. And uh, he said to me that was a masterclass bowling performance. And those words have stuck with me ever since that time. And uh, because Richie, you know, the doyen of cricket commentary, the fact that he made that comment, uh, suggested you really ad admired and enjoyed that performance, so I took that as a wonderful compliment. Yeah, can't get any better than that. Uh, in fact, the first test match um, of that series was at Trent Bridge, and uh, I was Richard Hadley in those days. Uh, but I knew that the, there was going to be an announcement, so, uh, but I was still Richard. And in some ways it would have been nice at Trent Bridge actually because that's where I played county cricket for 10 years to be known as Sir Richard, but it was, was here. And John Wright, our captain, uh, asked me to lead the team onto the field of play uh, the first morning of that match. And of course there was a ground announcement, people were aware of it anyway, standing ovation, applaud, uh, that sort of thing. And uh, just looking on the scoreboard, you know, Sir Richard Hadley, you know, it was just really special, out of this world. In fact, uh, I think I'm the only player ever to be knighted for services to cricket while still playing the game, so that made it even more special in itself. So that was a wonderful memory, um, didn't bowl that well, uh, I think got three for 100 plus, but I did score 86, which was my highest test score uh, here at Lords, so that was pleasing in itself. The, th the interesting thing about the honours board, uh, you know it's there uh, because you can just look at you know, the people who have scored hundreds or um, you know, got bags of five or more wickets and you don't think of actually being on it. You just think about contributing and doing your thing on the field to play and if you're fortunate enough and play well enough to get your hundred or to get five wickets and go on the honours board and you see your name up there, that is the, uh, the reward or the accolade if you like, but you don't go out there to plan it and go, I'm going to be on the honours board, it doesn't quite work that way. And perhaps the other uh, little magic memory for me is the, uh, the lunches here, uh, the players' lunches. And uh, Nancy was the lady in charge of looking after the players. And um, so I do have fond memories both on and off the field here at uh, Lords. Very, very special in my life. For more great videos at Lords, please subscribe.